Well, I've got an interesting situation here. This little colony right here, you can see they've got a little bit of drawn comb on top of this box. This is a swarm trap that I put out on the property where I have my hives now. And uh, I brought it back home just for a week to reorient so I can move it to the B spot because I caught it too close to the, the uh, B yard to just move it straight there. And then I had this here for a little while, like two days. I come home today and in my patio, I find this swarm of bees in this box from this foundation. This is a box of, from Right Cell Foundation. And the, these, this was in my patio. This building back here, you can see it has some open windows. The bees got in there and decided to make their residence in this box. <laughs> so, since they haven't really started on comb or anything, and I don't really have any more equipment, I'm gonna try combining these two. And I have no idea what's gonna happen because these guys are kind of established, but it's a small colony. You can see they've only got comb in the front here. And they're relatively calm, but it's a small, like, like I said, it's a small colony, so that doesn't mean anything. As they get bigger, they're gonna get mean. And this is a new swarm. So what I'm gonna try doing is smoking them both really good. And I'm gonna dump these bees in the box. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. See if they start fighting. Not too bad so far. I don't see a bunch of fighting. Huh. Well, they didn't go nuts, so I guess that's a plus. Well, that was uneventful, really. So, I guess that's what happens when you combine swarms. <laughs> At least that's what happened this time. Who knows, I could try it another time and have something else happen. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I can smell the Nassanov pheromone, the, uh, that lemongrass smell. Ooh, it's nice. A little bees on me. All right, well, I'll close it up and see, see if they meld together or what happens with them.